The current economic model is based on the assumption that we can produce and produce endlessly. If we continue like this, we would need two extra planets by 2050, and all three of these would be dirty. So we need to change our mindset. We have to stop this consumption and disposal spree and leave behind this linear economic model. This urge to buy and then throw away is threatening our planet, is threatening our health and also our economy. It doesn't make any sense. If we learn from nature, from its cycles, we will see that nothing is lost, but only transformed. Our consumption patterns are based on a linear take, make, dispose model. Things are not made to last, but it doesn't have to be like that. That is why we should turn this linear economy into a loop. We've introduced strong measures to prevent waste. EU member states will have to reduce food waste and marine litter, in line with the 50% reduction target of the UN Sustainable Development Goals. So many gadgets, especially phones, computers, tablets and electric appliances, could be designed to be recycled and reused. They should not be thrown away after a few years, but upgraded for extended use. Scarce raw materials and old tech products must be recovered. To stop a cycle that fuels exploitation and child labour for mining elsewhere in the world. The bioeconomic is an opportunity for innovation and jobs. We should be promoting new industries that will provide a sustainable growth model and will take care of the planet and of our health. What some see only as waste, we see as a valuable resource. A dangerous and highly pollutant substance like bio-waste can be turned into fertilizers for our farmers. Stop using harmful pesticides for a sustainable and healthy food industry. We need to step off the frenzied train of consumption and take a fresh look. The answers are there. Innovation is crucial, the citizens are calling for it and the lawmakers are ready.